Good day, Dominic Nation, and welcome to the vlog. It is Thursday, April 7th, and it is a dull, dreary day. Carol's finally figured out that whenever it rains, it's all crazy wet outside. Um, we lose our internet, telephone, and cable. So I'm gonna try and phone Rogers today and find out why that is. Why does that happen every time? it rains so when you call somebody out right now it just has this crackly sound on the phone so it's obviously something in their lines and i'm paying good money for that and i'm not getting any service so i'll have to complain uh right now i'm just compressing all the footage just put my pot a coffee on carol just left it's quarter after eight i have to put out the garbage it's garbage day today um got my new sweater on thanks to Muskoka Bear Wear. Um, Carl's coming today to drop off a drive. I have to go out and do a food review for Monday's video which is an A&W video. I have to shoot that today, have that in the can. Um, possibly uh, I need another oh and then oh and then tonight I have to go to Paul's house and we're gonna shoot another cook and review and that will be in the can for next week. We have to shoot another one because the week after I won't be here, so I'll have to figure something out. Something a bit easier to do. Maybe not as long. Anyway, time to get busy. Just uh, put out all of the garbage and recycling and composting and it started to pour rain. Luckily I had my trusty hoodie on and that kept my hair nice and dry. So uh, I grabbed myself a coffee and I'm just about to put together the, the vlog. It's nine o'clock. Everything so far is so good. And something just beeped. Oh, oh my, my uh, Arby's Euros tomorrow is due. So my computer's telling me what to do now. Okay, it is 9.45. Uh, the internet finally just snapped back on just in time because uh, I need to upload the vlog for you guys to watch. Just seeing how long, I've still got a few minutes to compress it there. But it's kind of taking my time because I'm thinking if the internet's down all day, then I can kind of take my time a little bit more and work a little bit harder on the vlog and add a little more, a couple things. There is one section of there with the animals uh, the pets sleeping and uh, I was actually going to put little thought bubbles of what they were dreaming about uh, but I just the internet's back on don't have time it would have been funny but don't have, don't have time um, Carl came dropped off the drive so I gotta start moving footage around um, gotta put some paperwork away I got my license renewal thing I gotta go get my license renewed driver's license and I don't have to do that until my birthday, really. But of course, you procrastinate until after your birthday. That's how it kind of usually happens. Anyway, so just letting you know, the Internet's back up and uh, I can upload the video. Yay. All right, guys, it's quarter after 10. Uh, right now, I am moving card data from here to here, moving data from here to here, getting all that done. And then I can put all that stuff away and that job's done. While I was doing that, I watched uh, Freak Eating's video of, <laughs> of Natter eating 64 slices of American cheese. That guy just fascinates me. Uh, I wish him well, he's like uh, 84,000 subs. So he's getting there. Gonna get to that 100,000 mark. All my friends need to be 100,000. Got to get them there. With a little help from our friends. Hey, you got to get some coffee. I poured the right amount of water today. I always pour too much usually. And shut that off. Get the spoon. Get the spoon. Use the leftover milk in our bag. Yep. So I'm, I'm a nice dad. I uh, take the little bit of the bag. Out. Oops, I haven't put a rebagged in there yet I'll get doing that right now done oh now I can fill that out hey uh, I think Megan and or Ben when they uh, when there's this so much milk left in the thing they just leave it 
Whereas I actually take the bag out and I put it off to the side, basically saying, drink this first and then put a brand new bag in the container, the holder. Anyway, so uh, yeah, I'm gonna get that done. I'm gonna finish up tomorrow's video, which is Arby's one. I did probably about a quarter of it yesterday. And uh, if I can get that all done and all this stuff out of my way, then I can take a big breath. I can do the um, product review uh, from the Netherlands, all those treats in the bag and get that shot and out of the way. And that'll probably go up on Sunday, Saturday or Sunday. Uh, this week has been a great week for putting up videos because I put up a video Monday, put up a video, sorry, let me start again. The Friday's video, which was the Burger King video did, sorry, it wasn't the Burger King, it was the McDonald's one, and that did really well. And then right after that, I did the Burger King one, which did really well. So having two really good videos back to back really also helped their 360 degree uh, sour candy video, which is probably the, the best uh, fastest growing video probably because it was 360 video that's ever been watched if I had done that on a normal uh, Tuesday throwing that up there it wouldn't have done as well but I guess because of the 360 so I got three videos that were doing very well back to back uh, and then Paul's um, cook and review and then today is the Thursday Thursdays tomorrow's gonna be Arby's Saturday should be that so it'll be like a full week of videos and uh, that'll get my views up nicely and because when the guys were here I was telling Carol this morning or yesterday when the guys were here I didn't I either missed a day or whatever or I can't remember what happened but uh, there was something I'm, I, I wasn't putting up as much videos or something like that and uh, my uh, everything kind of crashed and that doesn't help. I need everything to be up like that, just up. Okay, let's get busy. I had an email here I thought I would address. Um, it's from DeAndre who wants me to do a special video for the one year kind of anniversary of Missing Monkey 1 and 2, the disappearance. Um, he says you gave us a vlog about that happening to them April 20th 2015 missed those cats they knew that they was stars uh, thanks for thinking about it DeAndre um, there has been no news we thought we thought we saw the black cat on another road but we're not sure if it's if it was monkey 2 um, never seen monkey 1 since he disappeared no trace of him nobody knows anything about him uh, they are like they are gone uh, which is unfortunate you always hope that somebody found them and turned them into their pets and they're being loved and all that stuff stuff uh, and that's that's what I always hope that's that's just the way it goes um, so thanks for sending me uh, an email and asking about that um, I'll put up a quick picture of them one of the last pictures I ever took of them it's 12 25 right now totally finished Arby's uh, review of the of the euro uh, which is great because then I have the rest of the afternoon to do that video and I also have to do the Q&A video that I started through my social media yesterday. I asked people to go on Twitter. Uh, if you don't have Twitter, and if, if I do these more in the future, which I probably will, uh, if you don't have Twitter, you can always email me at kendomic at gmail.com because basically what I like about Twitter is uh, it tells me that somebody left a comment uh, on my Twitter and it actually emails me. So, and I like to utilize that social media because I don't I don't personally use it a lot I just know a lot of people do like it and again I like this fact that when people leave a comment there it actually emails me and then I have a whole list in my email and then I have a special folder called Q&A from Twitter and so as those comments come in or questions I just drag them into that so when I go to do my video I can just go and refer to those questions in that folder all right but if you don't have twitter and you don't want to use twitter whatever then just email me at kendomic at gmail.com cool cool right now it's quarter to two and i'm realizing how quickly i'm losing my day because i gotta get down to paul's house at four o'clock uh, i won't be able to do that today i'm gonna have to do that tomorrow but at least uh i completely finished the arby's video it's up uh it's getting right, oh sorry, it's all scheduled to go up tomorrow, so I'm good to go. Technically, I don't have to edit anything tomorrow except this vlog. Uh, I had my lunch, I had like a, the last of Paul's beans from last week. 
I hope I don't get sick because it's been a while. And then I also had an apple and a pear. So that's my protein, apple and pear, my my vet or my my good stuff. My, the pear is awesome for fiber. Uh, basically it's got my fruit into me, which is good. Still have to do this. Um, kitties, get out of the way. Busy man, busy man. I also have to drop off stuff at Carl's on the way down to Paul's. Uh, so, and I still have to do the uh, Q&A. So I'm gonna do that right now. And I gotta be careful because I have to use this camera. And I don't wanna waste my battery too much. So yeah, let's just get done. That was hilarious. It it is about uh, somebody just like honking at somebody. I don't know what the hell's going on. Let me cut him off. Uh, so Ben and I are driving over. We're gonna drop him off at Leah's house. Huh? Oh no, you're gonna work out. Yeah. And uh, then he's gonna go over after for dinner. And uh, I'm going to Paul's. I was gonna drop off drives and stuff to uh, Carl's, but uh, he's busy right now. So I'll do that tomorrow when I go and do another food review just for you. Uh, it'll be the a and I think Chipotle chicken, because I don't think I've done it yet. Anyway. All right, so as you can see, all the snow is completely gone. So I wonder if it'll come back again. Oh, it will come back again. I think so. Crazy, crazy, crazy weather. Crazy Canyon winter. Yeah. Slash I spring, I said slash summer. I said yesterday, it's, it's like, uh, um, It's supposed to be April showers bring May flowers, not April snowstorms crash your car. All right, so I will continue this vlog when we get to Paul's hairs. Ciao. Ciao. <laughs> <laughs> it's about 20 after uh, four. I smell bacon. I don't know why I smell bacon. Just outside your door, it smells like bacon. Bacon? Yeah. But, but you're not cooking bacon, so how can that be bacon? That's what I'm thinking. I'm like, what is going on? You've cooked so much bacon here that... Our house just permanently smells like bacon. It just smells like bacon. Like bacon. It is a... We're doing raw patties today. Bacon deluxe. How are you, sir? <laughs> <laughs> don't want to shake that oh, hand. Oh, yeah. That's after what I'm touch, about. After touching raw meat. Neat. Oh, check it out, people. Got... No, I, I've washed my hands. It's just they're still What are wet. we doing today? Uh, I'll give you a hint. Oh, right, the McDonald's thing. We're doing the, the Land, Land Air and Seaburger. Seaburger. Yes, we are. So I'm just getting stuff ready because there's so much involved in it. But we're going to make the sauces. We're going to do the batter the fish, bread the chicken. We're freaking we're awesome, man. Stack. Paul and I are done. Now we have to do a 10k walk. Which is gonna be really hard because the amount of food that we ate was ridiculous. Yeah, we're gonna walk for about 24 hours. Um, oh, that wasn't a good idea. LA Beast walked 60 miles in 22 hours. Straight, he didn't sleep or anything. He just, he, he, he walked, and I can't remember how many kilometers or miles, he walked from like from here to this point and that's like 10 kilometers or 10 miles. And then he walked home again. Uh, and then he did that three times. He'd stop at home and like rest for like an hour. But he never went to sleep, and he said he's like getting all wacky and weird. And I wouldn't mind doing like a 250k bike ride in a day, because I could do that in 11 hours. 10, 11 hours, no problem. Just got back to Paul's house. It's 8:25. I had to go pick up Ben. I think we did like just over 10 kilometers. It took about an hour and. 45 minutes to, to two hours. I accidentally shut off the app that was showing us how many kilometers we walked. And there he is, he's exhausted. He's pooped. I'm full, still. He's still full. I'm not, I don't feel full anymore, no. no. Really? Yeah. 
I could drink a huge glass of water, let me tell you. See, I clean I up the couch because I won't get off the couch. You don't have to clean up. I'm going to watch. Your children need to clean that up. I'm going to watch Quest for Fire tonight. Nice. Ding, da, ding, ding, ding. <laughs> 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 oh. oh, boy. All right. Okay, to finish off yesterday's vlog, uh, I got home and uh, did I pick up Ben? What did I do? Yes. 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 <laughs> oh boy. All these days are just running into each other. So yeah, from Paul's house, I went straight to pick up Ben. Picked up Ben, came home. I uh, gave the super sours to them so they can share them up. And, uh, and then throughout that, uh, something happened with CraveCon, I'll sh tell you tomorrow. And uh, then I kept looking at emails, dealing with stuff, and then I went to bed. And now it's time for Happy Birthday Shadows for Friday, April 8th, and they are Samuel, Josh, Francisco, Francisco, Francisco. That's fun to say. And Joanne, happy birthday to every single one of you guys. Don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below as to what you had for your special birthday dinner, whether you ate in or you ate out. Happy birthday.